Hi guys and welcome to another short video. Just because I have found this guy down in the local flea market. It's the Square Pants Bob Jack Specific Fry Cook Games console. I wasn't even aware that this thing actually exists, but it comes from 2005. So it sounds interesting. Unfortunately, the previous owner uh, or the guy who got rid of this left the batteries inside. I don't know how many years these batteries are there, uh, but the acid is all over the console and I need to clean it first thoroughly and then we can test and hopefully this thing uh, works. Now at this point I need to say that the acid that comes from uh, dead uh, old batteries is uh, very dangerous. It's actually poisonous and very dangerous. Now I'm flipping over the device and you can see that underneath we have a piece of paper which got full of particles, uh, full of crystals which actually is the um, acid that escaped from the batteries after all these years uh, and again clean uh, very carefully the surface, uh, your desk, uh, do not touch your face, ears, uh, eyes and needless to say your mouth. Throw away immediately the batteries, uh, recycle them like I did and now after a couple of days uh, I have placed new batteries inside this cover. Uh, what I did, I cleaned the contacts everywhere, uh, positive and negative contacts, uh, contact points uh, where the battery compartment is with vinegar, pure vinegar it's the best way to clean the whole compartment and the contacts because vinegar actually neutralizes uh, the acid and since this whole compartment was flooded with vinegar previously I left it out in the sun for two days that's why um, I'm going on with this video after two days that everything is clean and neat and I'm going to test it so far what I did I um, managed to only visually inspect the device and it looks nice uh, the joystick uh, looks okay has a couple of buttons and um, what I did uh, also I uh, switched it on without uh, connecting it to the TV yet because I just wanted to do this with you online um, so the power comes up hmm, and uh, that's very very promising the, the LED comes up so let's put it on the TV and see if this thing actually works. It's going to be fantastic. Yeah, yeah, we have a signal. Jack's specific logo comes on the screen. Um, 2005 is that? And the Fry Cook Games main menu. Great. So what do I do now? It says press A. It only has uh, two buttons, A and B. Uh, the A button is bigger, so I guess it works like the fire button, we, as we used to say. So let's press A and check the menu and what other options we have. As uh, I have already pressed button B, it doesn't do anything. So let's press A and we have selection of a character, is that it? Yeah, the user or the gamer's profile, A and B, you can put uh, three characters to indicate your name and we have uh, training mode wow it's interesting uh, we have multiplayer multiplayer that's good the galleries what, what whatever is this records ah it's keeping records high records competition this should be it the uh, game itself training mode again and what else is there mm, multiplayer oh so it's the same circle again so multiplayer galleries um, training and uh, the actual game so let's go to records I don't believe there's no there's nothing in here but it can keep your highest scores I believe event awards and stuff like that that's interesting uh, records uh, no records recorded so far from the previous owner but I believe the memory must have gone um, training mode we don't need that do we need that ah so we have how's that one two three four five six nine stages 
but I believe the uh, initial stage for every game is only available because the other the rest are locked locked so it works maybe with uh, qualifying rounds that's my guess and so let's go to competition which is the main menu and we have bikini bottom is the first uh, classic game which is available but requires qualifiers the crusty crab which is locked how interesting is that the jellyfish fields which is locked again the gulagoon championships locked again and the fryku games itself locked again and then we go back to the beginning bikini bottom which requires qualifier round that's interesting so you cannot start and move to the next game before you are qualified that's interesting um, okay let's see if I can go over some qualifying uh, round and check my options and uh, let's let's see what I can do and uh, let's see how many qualifying rounds should I go through so it's one two three four five six six in other words six games before you go into the first game and so the first one is called the runaway tray and um, I'm moving the joystick up and down so I can select but there are uh, pre-selected I believe so uh, you have to go one by one in this pre-selected uh, mode and uh, complete all the challenges the runaway tray is the tray with the candies that you need to deliver and you have to run and run and speed up by moving the joystick to the right uh, if you want to and of course you have to deliver all the candies uh, on time and you have to make it fast it's uh, funny and uh, wow darn I'm good the fire button uh, in other words the A button is used in order to go over the obstacles congratulations damn I'm good I'm so good and so second to go over is the air party uh, you have to I don't know what to do um, things are falling and uh, actually food is falling over my head and I have to somehow control it not to fall in the ground um, the fry cook games are based on events or sports like um, games related to food as you can tell so you have to deal with food all the time and I think before this one there was another console back in 2003 um, as a plug-and-play console I don't know if it was the first one but uh, definitely this is not the first one 2005 the fry cook games oh boy this is hard I'm not sure I can qualify over this game here hey hey oh boy I really suck on this one I have some points I don't know if this is enough it's the first time that I'm doing this and I'm trying to get qualified to the next one so I have what uh, 1150 points congratulations wow let's go to the next one uh, stack a snack so burgers are falling from the sky and you have to cut them which is not an easy task oh boy what is going on here one two how's that three four and burgers are keep falling and <laughs> trying to cut up but oh boy I really suck I don't know um, and so this is the, the the third one we have three more to go and get qualified and finally play some games it's funny and it's uh, smart and interesting falling burgers from the sky and you have to catch them and uh, stuck them up wow falling up and then I don't know why are they going away at some point I'm trying it's not easy I'm telling you it's not easy it's a challenging game I don't know for kids but for me it's <laughs> it's hard already okay I must have served some or no I'm, I'm I suck big time oh boy so total zero wow wow and then, congratulations for what let's go to the next one see if I can get myself qualified in the end 
and what's the next one oh this one is the one that uh, you have to okay we have yellow and red targets and we are throwing ketchup and mustard over the burgers okay this this one looks funny uh, and um, I'm good I'm good and it's the patty sauce showdown wow fancy name so and then the burgers are coming the other way around and so you have to put mustard and ketchup on, um, both I mean on each burger that comes um, along wow it's funny and the sound is funny the idea is great I mean these are smart um, games for the kids after all they can understand uh, <laughs> at least how they can make um, a burger by the end of the day okay oh I'm good oh, I'm good wow what happened here so I have some points Woo, quite a few points here gathered congratulations darn I'm good and uh, pff, let's go to the next one grill skating okay this one you need to just follow the directions that are coming up uh, for you to uh, put the stick uh, the joystick uh, to the left to the right press a whatever the um, notification that pops up is telling you to do up up and down down and you are collecting points a press a go up press a and the guy is skating and you are gathering points I don't know how many points I do I, how many points do I have to to gather in order to get qualified I don't know uh, okay so I'm doing whatever he's telling me to do up down and um, right up left down up up press a up a and we're done I have some points here I don't know if this is enough good enough or what and of course it will tell me again that yeah congratulations oh, thank you very much I don't know if this is good enough um, and then jelly flood what is jelly flop it's jelly flop so you are jumping over the jello and you are doing figures and uh, each figure must be very sophisticated and hard in order to get points and <laughs> it's funny okay the least I can say it's funny you do combos you do loops and <laughs> it's funny and entertaining and then you have to oh you go from one jello mattress to the other and okay it sounds fun and there is a, a time um, countdown that you have to do the best that you can to collect points uh, until this countdown reaches uh, zero okay it's funny let's see what I can do at least it is the last one and uh, maybe if I get myself qualified then I can uh, uh, go to the main games after this challenge it's the last one give me the points that I need Damn. oh boy it's over jelly flop flop jelly flop congratulations I know that let's go to the games let's go to the main games oh there's a, a ceremony so where am I back to the main menu bikini bottom qualifiers crusty crab locked again jellyfish fields locked again goo lagoon locked again fry cook games locked again and back to bikini bottom qualifiers no I'm not gonna do this guys no 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 I'm telling you no I'm not gonna do this again no I'm gonna go back to the main menu sorry for that I'm actually going to reset the console and go back from the very beginning that's right <laughs> okay it was uh, funny and uh, tough for me now let's get uh, back to serious mode um, it is an interesting little plug-and-play console by Jax uh, Pacific they have always been able to produce and introduce um, quality made uh, consoles and I do know that some guys are collecting these consoles personally I'm not interested in but um, yeah I can understand that I do collect other uh, retro stuff and games and computers and uh, electronic equipment that far I know um, 
but in any case this is a very interesting and uh, smart console for kids um, they are going over challenges related to food and uh, candies and stuff uh, things that uh, is making the gameplay easier for them to understand if uh, you have had this uh, as a kid or have played and uh, have memories around this console please let me know in, down in the comment section don't forget to subscribe I uh, hope you liked it and uh, you found this um, video interesting and entertaining um, and um, by all means uh, share whatever you want to share down in the comment section and at this point I think I'm gonna call it a wrap and um, I'll catch you soon with another video another uh, game system console retro computer uh, fixes uh, um, uh, repairs upgrades whatever comes in mind and whatever comes handy so yeah that was all for now thanks for watching bye for now